the function shell of the Arduino board. First, we will describe about the detail of the multifunction shell. Uh, first, this is the LED. The LED will connect into pin digital 13, 12, 11, and 10. And the LED have four light. The LED 1, 2, 3, and 4. Next, this is the buzzer. The buzzer is used for the sound in an experiment. We can use the sound to make a song also. Next is the switch, the button switch. We can control our experiment by using them. Next is the seven segment. We use this to show the number or we can show the word or letter in this segment. This is the experiment of the shield. The first experiment is using the LED uh, to make a light function. Next is we use buzzer to make songs. And we use, next we use switch to make a, an experiment for the LED light and we use the we use the function shield to read the resistance and the last one is we use the seven segment to to tell us the digit of number and other things that it can do. So this is the first experiment. This is the code in Arduino. Uh, first, we set the LED uh, into pin 13, 12, 11, and 10. And then we set the LED into output. In one second, the LED will high. And another in one second, the LED will low f delay for one second. And this is the experiment. You can see that the LED uh, will light out in one second and low in one second. And this is the second experiment. This experiment will use the buzzer in the shield of the Arduino board. First, we set the buzzer in pin 3 after that, we set the buzzer in to put out and the buzzer will high and delay one second and the, then the buzzer will low in one, delay one second too. It will be like this. This is the third experiment. In this experiment, we will read the uh, resistor. First, we set the port part 1 into analog 0 and we we'll connect the LED into uh, digital 13, 12, 11 and 10. After that we set the LED into output. If the part value that we set is uh, lower than 400, the LED light will be low. And then if the part value is more than 400, the light will be high, delay in 0 0.5 seconds. And this is the fourth experiment. In this experiment, we will use the button to control the LED light. Uh, we set the button one into analog one and we we'll set the LED into pin 13, 12, 11, 10. After that, we let the LED into output and button to be input. 
So after that, if we uh, press the switch one time, uh, the digital light will be high or the LED will be high. Else, uh, if we didn't press the button, the LED will be low, delay in 500 milliseconds. And this is the result from the Ford experiment. You can see that after I press the first button, the LED light will be work. And if I didn't press the button, the LED light be closed. And this is the last experiment in this video. Uh, this experiment, we will measure the temperature. First, in this experiment, we will use DHT11. The, D, the DHT11 detail have VCC we connect into 5 volt or 3 volt uh, and we have ground and data ground will connect into ground the same and the data will connect into 2 and after that we connect the pin of the DHT 1 1 or 11 into pin 5 after that we let it print into and set the temperature into zero and humidity into zero too. After the DHT 11 work, they will several pin the temperature in Celsius and the humidity into uh, high. <laughs>